Hi guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to crochet this pig with hat and messenger bag and step by step. And this is the material bag, including the stuffing and video instruction and the crochet hook, different colors of yarns, stitch marker, safety eyes and needles. And now we are going to use the light pink yarn for the body of the pig. And I'm going to just go around my pinky finger and that finger and middle finger and hold the X section here and grab the crochet hook. You can grab it like this or you can hold it like this. I'd like to hold it like this and we go under the loop and yeah, over two through, yarn over, two through. So this is a chain. I'm going to start by working in a round and join together at the end of each round to create a metric ring. So the next step is just go under the big loops, yarn over, pull through yarn over and pull through two little loops on your hook so we got a single crochet a reshaped stitch this is a reshaped stitch reshaped stitch and we would like to put on the stitch marker here so we can easily find out the first stitch on the stitch marker here and lock and the next one is the same we are going to do a single crochet again just go under the hopes over pull through the hole over to the two little loops on your hook this is the second single crochet and again three single crochet here and four single crochet five single crochet six single crochet as we can see this little end and I'm going to pull it tight to create a magic ring so here we're almost done don't forget to put on the stitch marker for the last stitch this is the last stitch for round one we have six stitches we have done six single crochet and six stitches total mark the last stitch and we take off the stitch marker for the first stitch i'm going to join the first stitch here is the first stitch you can see the reshape stitch and we go under the stitch go under the stitch now over pull through and pull the first one through the second one so this is a slip stitch and now over again pull through this little hole so we can make it loose and this is a chain 
So for round two, I'm going to do six increase total, one in each. So this is the first stitch that we just slip stitch into. I am going to here do the first increase here. To go under the first stitch, you over, pull you over, pull So this is our first stitch, and also don't forget to put on the stitch marker for the first and last stitch. Here we put on the stitch marker. And increase means two single crochet to the same stitch. So we also need to do another single crochet to the same stitch here. Single crochet here. And the next one is also increase means two single crochet to the same stitch. If you are not familiar for the single crochet, or increase and also the slip, slip stitch and the uh, uh, chain you can check my other video it has step-by-step -step video for the tutorial and the next one also increase and increase we do increase for every stitch and there is six stitch for round one, so we need to do six increase for round two. Take off the stitch marker for the last stitch. And this is the last stitch. Put on the stitch marker. stitch and lock for round two we have 12 stitches total then take out the stitch marker for the first stitch and we go into the first stitch and over pull and pull to slip stitch in chain one and now I'm going to do the next round round three for round three I'm going to do single crochet in for the first stitch and the next one is increasing repeat six times total so the first one is the first one is always the first stitch that we slip stitch to single crochet and put on the stitch marker for the first stitch and the next one is increase means two single crochet to the same stitch and just repeat all those process until the end and there is six times total the next one is also single crochet and increase and single crochet and increase for the next single crochet increase Single crochet, increase, and the last one is increase. And we mark 
the last stitch using the stitch marker for the last stitch so this is one three we have 18 stitches total and one four I'm going to just slip stitch first slip stitch to the first stitch so so and when you make the slip stitch in the first chain you need to pull this yarn tight and then you need to make it loose for the first stitch so the first stitch here we do a single crochet for round four the first one is single crochet and mark the first stitch and the second one is increase increase and the next one is also single crochet and repeat one single crochet one increase and one single crochet repeat all those process until the end so we have six times total Mark the last stitch and now we slip stitch to join the first stitch here and we chain one and make it loose. Now we are going to do the one five. So for one four we have 24 stitches total for round five i'm going to do three single crochet one increase and repeat six times total so the first one is single crochet now mark the first stitch using the stitch marker and two single crochet three single crochet and the next one is increase so this is three single crochet one increase and repeat this process until the end For round 5, we have 30 stitches total. And we mark the first, the last stitch. And we have done 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 rounds. Now we have 30 stitches and we slip stitch to the first stitch. Let's make it tight and pull up and chain one and make it loose. And for one six, I'm going to do single crochet one in each. Mark, put on the stitch marker for the first stitch. And we just single crochet to every stitch 
one single crochet, one stitch. So we have done 30, sti 30 single crochet and we have 30 stitches. Put on the stitch marker for the last stitch. And slip stitch. Chain 1. For round 7 we will, we are going to do Two single crochet, one increase, and two single crochet. Repeat six times total. So the first one is single crochet, and put on the stitch marker, and single crochet again. And the next one is increase, and two single crochet. Just repeat. Two single crochet, one increase, and two single crochet until the end. The last two stitches are single crochet. Put on the stitch marker for the last stitch. So for round seven, we have thirty-six stitches. For round seven, we have thirty-six stitches, and we slip stitch. Slip stitch and chain one and make it loose. And for round eight and round nine, we are going to do single crochet to every single stitch. Mark the first stitch and just do 36 single crochet one in each. Four. And for round 9, we are going to do the same, just single crochet to every single stitch. Put on the stitch marker for the last stitch. And slip stitch. Slip stitch to the first stitch to drawing and pull through the yeah, over pull through to do a chain. And single crochet. So this is round nine. We are going to do single crochet, just like round eight. Just single crochet to every single stitch.
don't forget to put on the stitch marker for the last stitch and slip stitch and we chain one for round 10 i'm going to do five single crochet one increase repeat six times total mark the first stitch and we have just done one single crochet and two three four five and the last one in the row is increase so five single crochet one increase and uh, we need to do it all those process until the end On the stitch marker for round 10 we have 42 stitches total and for round 11 to round 13 I'm going to do 42 single crochet one in each slip stitch and chain one first one so for round 10, 11 I'm going to do single crochet all the way around just one in each and for round 12 and one 13 is all the same So for round 13 we have 42 stitches and we are going to slip stitch to the first one and chain one for round 14 I'm going to do five single crochet one decrease so five single crochet one on the stitch marker for the first one in two in three four five and the next one is decrease means pick, we pick up the foam loop only for the next two stitches foam loops only yeah over the foam loops now over put the two little loops on your hook so this is a decrease and we repeat 
five single crochet one decrease until the end so it's six times total two three four five pick up from loops only Form loop and form loops. We mark the last stitch. Perform round 14, we have 36 stitches total. And let's continue to the next. We slip stitch and chain one. And for round 15, we are going to do two single crochet, one decrease, and two single crochet repeat until the end. So we are going to repeat six times. This one is single crochet. And two single crochet. And decrease. And two single crochet. Two single crochet, one decrease, and two single crochet repeat until the end So we have 30 stitches and now I'm going to insert the safety eyes and this is the back side and this is the front side and and the safety eyes should be in so to the wrong seven one two three four five six seven it should be here and one two three four four stitches away so next side and from side and one two three four five six seven here one, two, three, four. It's like here. Four stitches away from each other. So one, two, three, four. Should be like here. And since this is the back side and this is the front side, I think we should move it to one stitch to the left. So here. This one.
for one. Fifteen, we have thirty stitches. Let's continue to the next round. For round sixteen, slip stitch to join in chain one. And we do three single crochet, one decrease for six times. Single crochet, put on the stitch marker in two single crochet, three, and we do one decrease and repeat all those process all the way around. And slip stitch to join the first stitch in chain one for on 16 sorry we have 24 stitches and for round 17 I'm going to do one single crochet one decrease and one single crochet six times First one is single crochet and the next one is decrease and single crochet. We do one single crochet, one decrease and one single crochet in a row and repeat all the way around. Put on the stitch marker for the last stitch. For round 17, we have 18 stitches all the way around. I'm going to stuffing the body of the pig. Slip stitch in chain one around eighteen. I'm going to do one single crochet, one decrease. First one is single crochet. Put on the stitch marker and one decrease. Six times total. On the stitch marker and 
for the last round of round 19 we are going to do 6 decrease slip stitch first in chain 1 so now we pick up the front loop only front loops to do a decrease this is the first stitch so we need to put on the stitch marker for the first one and we do 6 decrease just decrease all the way around until the end Pick up some loops on me You can squeeze it like this and it will be easier for you to pick up the foam loop And the last one We slip stitch to the first stitch and chain one. So there is a little hole in the middle. We're gonna conceal it. Cut it sh not that long and not that short. Just thread it to the needle. I'm going to conceal this. Also, we insert it to pick up the form loop for me for every stitch form loop for me just in and out form loop and just pull it tight We finished the body and now I'm going to crochet the ears And the ears should be here in one Four, one, two, three, four So it should be here Oh. One, two, three, four, here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. 
I'm going to change from two, three, four, and on the second last train, one, two, second last train, one, two, this is the second last train. We are going to do a single crochet, and the next one is half double crochet and the next one is double crochet so for the first two and the last two two three four here I'm going to slip stitch here Trim, trim this yarn. The left side, I'm going to start from round four here. And from the second last string, I'm going to do a single crochet and half double crochet. Just pull through all and double crochet for the last one. stitch here
so we have finished two ears and now I'm going to crochet the hem or legs for the pig and the hand and the back is all the same so just one instruction repeat four times I'm going to chain make a slip knot into the slip knot put it tight and we and we chain four two three four and then from the second last chain we do here second last chain we do a half double crochet and over first here we do into the loop and over puzzle and over puzzle all three loops and the next one is also half double crochet and the last one is single crochet here is the last one we do a single crochet and lift long end for sewing repeat to get four two hands and two legs we now have four of this piece I'm going to crochet sew it to the body and I think it, it should be in the one ten one two three four five six seven eight nine ten maybe here
Who the next should be? One, two, three, four. Four and five. Two, three, four. four. Should be in one between one, four, and one, five. That's the last. And I'm going to crochet the nose. Let's take out our dark pink yarn and let's start with a slip knot. And I'm going to chain one, two, three. And from the middle chain here, pick up the back loop only over over proof we do one single crochet for the second last chain and here we do the next one we do increase one and two and for the next one single crochet and the next one I'm going to do increase again and now you can find that this is the first single crochet and I'm going to slip stitch here and we get and we got nose I'm gonna trim the yarn to the needle and 
This is the next chain, next stitch. Going to insert to the middle of next stitch. Let's take out the light pink yarn and we need to take one of this and gonna crochet so the nose trail to crochet so the nose to the body
I'm going to crochet the hair. Look at the yellow. The yellow one and go around your pinky finger, index finger and middle finger. Hold the thumb. Then we go under the loop and over puzzle and over puzzle. We start by metric being with six single crochet. Mark the first one. And two and three and four five six and put on the stitch marker for the last stitch. Pull the tail end tight and we slip stitch to join the first stitch. <clears throat> And chain one around two. I'm going to do six increase. Put on the stitch marker for the first stitch. Increase means two single crochet to the same stitch. And just increase all the way around. And for round two, we will have twelve stitches. And the last one. Put on the stitch marker for the last stitch. We have 12 stitches now. And slip stitch. Chain one. For round three, I'm going to do one single crochet, one increase and repeat. Six times total. This one is single crochet. Put on the stitch marker. And the second one is increase. And repeat until the end. The last one is increase. Put on the stitch marker for the last stitch. We have 18 stitches for round 3 and slip stitch. And chain 1 and for round 4, I'm going to do 18 single crochet, one in each. So just single crochet until the end. On the stitch marker for the last stitch, for round four, and for round five, I'm going to do one 
one single crochet, one increase, and one single crochet. For form loop only. So I'm gonna just pick up the form loop. Here is the form loop. The over puzzle, over puzzle. The first one is single crochet. And the second is increase form loop only. So for round five, we are going to do form loop only all the way around. And the next one, single crochet. Repeat one single crochet, one increase, and one single crochet until the end. We have six times. And the last one is single crochet. Put on the stitch marker. For round five, we have 24 stitches. Slip stitch in chain one. For round six, I'm going to, 20, to do 24 single crochet. Put on the stitch marker. 24 single crochet, one in each. Just single crochet all the way around. The last one. And slip stitch. Take one. And now we have finished the hat. Start by a slip knot and in chain four one two three four and we do single crochet to form the second last chain here single crochet and the next one is also single crochet and the third one we do same stitch and cut it repeat to get another one
we can sew into you can sew it to the pig just to fix it or you can just make it removable so that you can flip it over to for another style I'm gonna crochet the messenger bag and we start by a slip knot And let's chain six. One, two, three, four, five, six. From the second last chain, this is the last one, and this is the second last one. You can pick up the back loop only, pick up one side only, and over perfectly, and over perfectly. You do a single crochet, and this is the first stitch I'm going to. Put on the stitch marker and the next one is also single crochet and single crochet three single crochet and four single crochet and the last one is I'm gonna do last train I'm gonna do three single crochet in the same chain one two and three and the next one here is the next one because we have six chain here so one two three four five six this is uh, the one that we just did three single crochet into. So this is the next one. I'm going to do a single crochet here. And the next one also single crochet. And the next one single crochet again. Always put the tail end up to the hook so we can hide it into the stitch. We just did three single crochet and the last one I'm going to do an increase one and two single crochet to the same stitch to the same chain and mark the last stitch now we have 12 stitches one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve and slip stitch And chain one and we do single crochet for round two just 12 single crochet one in each two three four five six seven for round three and round four just single crochet all the same I'm gonna skip to the end of the round four so I have finished uh, this the last one also single crochet and we slip stitch I finish round four and chain Like two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, nineteen, twenty. It's not long enough. Twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirteen. I think five more. Thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five. Thirty six, thirty seven, thirty eight, thirty nine, forty. Forty is choosing love. And we slip stitch here. Put it inside the bag. Make the cherry to the back. Let me tie a knot here. Go back. And now we tie a knot here. And this one.
finish the messenger bag. So the hat we can fix it here. I'm not gonna fix it. I'm just going to Oh, I forgot to put on the It makes it more cute.